everyone. So, um, yeah, Valentine's Day is coming back up, so, um, yep, it's time to learn Valentine's Day effect. So, I'm gonna be teaching you how to make a Valentine's shockwave. Um, you know, I already have all of my clips and music synced up because I'm figuring um, you're probably smart enough to do that yourself if you're even looking at this tutorial. So yeah, and it's also just to save time so you guys don't have to watch me sync up a bunch of clips. Anyways, yeah, so, um, in order to make the effect, so all the downloads for the presets and the dot setting files are going to be in my Discord server. Um, if you're just there for the effects, just leave afterwards. I don't really care and I don't want you to stick around if you're not going to talk. Anyways, so yeah, um, shift and then left arrow key twice to go back two seconds. Um, cut it here copy this move it up paste and then copy this move it up and then paste it again and then uh, make sure the bottom clip is just one full clip so just do that and then here's where we use our first preset for the color correcting now um when uh, uh xbox game bar doesn't record file explorer but i'm just gonna tell you what i'm doing so i'm just dragging out the um color corrector it's called valentine's cc dust setting i'm just dragging it out see it appears right there and then just connect it up and then yeah you got your color corrector in. um if you want to like tone down anything i'm just gonna okay yeah so basically what you gotta do is just zoom in um and then open these in fusion so yeah and then first before you do that make them into combat clips i'll explain why we're doing that later uh fade them both in by 40 seconds approximately i mean if you want it to be faster then that's fine too uh open the bottom one in fusion um yep and then basically what you gotta do is just drag in the presets so first drag in the big heart mask dust setting so, just a second. Yep, alright. Um, by the way, this is voiceover because the mic quality broke. Anyways, yeah, so, um, once you drag this in, it should look something like this. The heart should expand, and then, by the last 12 frames, it should rapidly grow smaller like that and then what you want to do is get the shockwave dot setting and drag it in sorry if my actions don't match up with my voice because again this is a voiceover anyways yeah so um yeah just connect these up and then you've got your heart shockwave now we need to go into the other compound clip and this is for making it so that the inside of the heart isn't just solid and it's actually got like you know stuff inside like like um a space inside to make it look more like a shockwave so just drag in the small heart mask dust setting which is that um and then yeah it's got a smaller heart that expands outwards um and then what you want to do is add the valentine's color corrector once more uh I'm pretty sure I made a mistake here. Yeah, um, ignore that. Uh, it should be Valentine's CC dot setting. So, past me, past you may, should have dragged that in in just a second. Yep, there it is. Um, just connect that up, and you're pretty much done. Um, but, for the other effects. So, um, all of the other effects are either from previous tutorials um so or um my editing pack so you shouldn't have to make anything on your own so basically what i'm doing here is adding an aggressive shake which is from one of my old tutorials i'll put that in a card and it should be in the top uh top right corner and also um there's gonna be some shakes from my editing pack and a pinch build up from my editing pack so yeah i'll be dragging those in and that's pretty much it